Jack was diagnosed in April 2003 um, and prior to that he was about two years of age and we just noticed that he wasn't going upstairs like his peers were. Um, he wanted to use the buggy more so and obviously when you get to be in a toddler you're usually full of energy. Um, so we got referred to a physiotherapist and then ultimately on to a neurologist um, who basically told us um, that unfortunately Jack had got something called Duchenne muscular dystrophy. Obviously when we found out it was kind of like the whole world fell apart, um, it was like falling into a black hole and at the time there was nothing on the horizon as regards treatment other than uh, steroid treatment. We actually uh, registered with the DMD genetic registry which is uh, coordinated by Action Duchenne, the charity. Um, and they keep a database of genetic details so that researchers can obviously look at who's most appropriate to access the trial that they're running. Um, and fortunately Jack and Tom obviously fit the criteria. For Jack, he's kind of on the cusp of going off his feet and uh, I think it maintained his mobility, we think, for longer. Um, it's very difficult to obviously gauge that, um, but with Tom there was definitely significant changes in the fact that he wasn't falling asleep when he was on the settee, um, he'd got lo lots more energy, was less fatigued and um, he was obviously able to play with his friends and play football which he really loves.